Hey guys, my name is Raquel, but you can call me Rocky. Welcome if you're new, welcome back if you're not. Today I am going to be following a makeup tutorial by Vogue. I'm going to be doing Euphoria's Alexa Demi's 90s glam tutorial. I have it on in the background there. So let's get started. Hi Vogue, it's Alexa Demi. I'm going to be doing a little 90s nude glam. I just I'm washed my with face. It's all organic and it's made out of vegetables and, you know, flowers, botanicals. It's just all natural. Spray it on my face. So the hydrating mist that I will be using is the Mario Brescu, um, the facial spray with aloe, cucumber, and green tea. So I don't really have serum, but I do have this Estee Lauder night cream, which I think is kind of like a serum, so I'm just going to use this. So after I do my serum, I like to use the Dior Backstage Primer. The Skin Refined, this is just a sample, the Skin Refined um, Zone by MAC is pretty similar. But I'm just going to apply this on my T-zone. I like the feel of a fluffy brush and I like to kind of work it in my skin without it being too heavy. Okay, so she applies her foundation with a fluffy brush, which I've never done before, but we're going to do it today. Um, I'm going to be using the, I'm using MAC foundation, uh, Mineralize in the shade NC42. Editorial look, so she brought me and I was like, 12 years old and she did the craziest most beautiful like editorial look on me and I loved it I didn't want to take it off but she's really good at eyes and she's all about blending so my like my whole life she's always been like blend 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 she doesn't really like harsh lines just to bring it down into my neck but now I'm gonna go in and use my NARS concealer I always bring it up and around the eye. Okay, so the closest thing I have to the concealer that she has is the NYX HD, but this is a little too dark for highlighting, so I'm going to mix it with the LA Girl Pro Coverage. This. I'm going to mix them together to make a concealer shade for myself. I like share and different artists from back in the day. And I kind of like to not like just recreate it completely, but just take pieces from each of those pictures and kind of do my own thing. Okay, so in the video she uses a double-ended brush to blend out the concealer, so I'm going to use these two brushes, a foundation brush and a concealer brush. Have a flat end. I love baking. I, I don't bake anywhere else. Okay, so just, I'm going to be honest, using the Maybelline Shine Free Loose Powder just, in the shade falls, Light. Really, you can take it off.
Okay, so I never bake, but we're doing it we're doing it today, so Okay, now we're going to get started on the eyeshadow. She she's using um Dior. I don't have Dior, so I'm going to be using this Beauty Creations on a palette. So, she took a cream kind of shade and is using a br like a flat brush like this. So, I'm going to take this shade right here and apply it to my lid like how she's doing right now. Into the eye. I'm going to go into my crease with a slightly darker color. And I'm going to take this color here to work in my crease. Okay, now I'm going to take this this brown shade right here and blend it into my crease i go in with a little bit of this pat over pat mcgrath over the dior Okay, now I'm going to go in with this dark brown shade and blend that over to deepen it up, which is what it seems like she did. So next she takes kind of like a brownish gold shade and puts it into the crease. So I'm going to take this shade right here and do just that. Pat McGrath glitter on the lid. Okay, so she puts a shimmer on the okay, lid. I'm going to add a little bit of highlight under the brow. I'm going to be using this shade to apply to the lid and also so to, to the, the brow bone. And now she's doing winged eyeliner, so I'm going to take my NYX Professional Makeup Epic Ink Liner in black and do a wing. Kind of just, I start at the, on the outer corner of my eye. Just a little bit of a highlight and then I'm going to go in with I don't like it like too curled up to me. I, I don't know, I just kind of just, I, I've done it. My, I just follow my eye here, but I just, it needs to be really pointy. So I kind of just start like that. And then I always get a Q-tip and I'm going to go here. bring the inner corner in to give me that like fierce jaguar look. So I'm going to do a little bit of blush. That's kind of cute. <laughs> okay. Okay, next for... Okay, I'm going to dust this off because I just realized she just dusted it off. And then after I'm going to apply this Tarte blush in the shade Ohana. She would always say, smile. I bring it up a little bit into the hairline. So I like to use this Dior um, contour palette. So 
Next, I'm going to take the LA Colors Contour Palette and I'm going to contour with this. So now that I've done my contour, I'm just going to go in with a little bit of bronzer. I just like to lightly dust. I'm going to do a little bit of the Dior highlighter. I'm going to blend these two. And now for highlight, I'm going to be going into the Anastasia Glow Kit. And I'm going to mix the shade Summer and the shade Moonstone. Like, that's been one of the best parts about filming is that we all instantly connected. So I'm going to go in. I'm huge. I don't ever not wear lip liners. So I'm going to go in with this Dior lip liner. And sometimes I even layer lip liners, which I think I love you today. Marilyn Monroe look once. And I, I just looked up, like, her makeup artist's process. And apparently they would layer, like, seven different reds on her lip okay to get a similar look i'm going to use this rust orange rust um lip liner this is from sephora in the shade a little rusty and then since she used a nude and then a brown gloss i'm just going to use this nude glossy liquid lip and I just always i'm just gonna like, apply you know, some lip conditioner on first this is by I mac my signature thing that I've just become obsessed with. I'm layering another gloss on top of that. This Dior Lip Maximizer, just to give it a little something in the center. So I have my wing and my nails. It's always like just my thing. Oh, my brows. I can't forget my brows. So I don't fill in my brows. Um, not because I don't like it, I just really don't know how. And I've kind of just, I've, for like three years, I didn't do anything to my brows, and I recently got them like shaped, so it's new for me. But I just like to do brow gel. Like I can't go anywhere without my brow gel. Okay, so for my brows, I'm going to be using the MAC Pro Longwear Waterproof Brow Set. This is in the shade Quiet Brunette, so it's not clear. So it's going to it's gonna give me a little bit of something since um, I have less eyebrow than she does. So I'm going to take um, a brow pencil and just fill in my tail and then add the gel to the rest of the brow. Okay, next I'm going to apply some mascara. This is the Maybelline uh, Colossal Volume Lash Waterproof. I always do this and fan my lashes and everybody always laughs at me. I love playing Maddie. I, I, she really, you know, I keep saying like she really pulled me out of my comfort zone in a lot of ways. Because it was the first time I feel like, well not the first time, but with her... Since we worked on it for so long, I was able to kind of like really get into her and grow with her. And, you know, she would piss me off sometimes with some of her decisions. She's bold. I think she's dealing with a lot of emotional trauma at home. And so a lot of her decisions are, you know, they're not the smartest, but she's doing the best that she can. So now I'm just going to set it with that same hydrating mist that I used in the beginning just to kind of let it all get into the Skin. Okay, so after I finish with the mascara, we're gonna spray our face with the same facial spray we did in the beginning, and then we're done, I guess. Okay.
Okay, so again, we're going in with the Mario Badescu Skincare Facial Spray with Aloe, Cucumber, and Green Tea. Okay, so this is the final look. Um, I will link that video down in the description if you guys want to check out the full video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give this video a like, comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!